my hoard. Yes, I am still sitting here on the same day opening toys because this is what I do on my day off. Because this is... This is what brings me the joy. <laughs> Um, so today I have a couple of these boxy girls. Uh, if you'll remember, I did an actual doll review on these a little while back. Um, but these are tangential things. There are, this one is a mini figure of one of the boxy girls, and then it, I guess an accessory for her, and then also uh, a cute little pet. Um, let's start with the doll, and we'll see what we get. All right, uh, already a little bit overpackaged. Plas plastic inside plastic. That's whatever. And um, let's see. This is okay. This is Trinity. She's got a cute little pink hairstyle going on there. Let's pop her out of her plastic prison. Oh, there's a tape on it. There's tape down there. That's nonsense. Nonsense, y'all. Anyway. Here she's got a pink with some little sides coming out of her little buns. Um, she does have... Yes, a uh, removable plastic clothing here, uh, soft, soft plastic clothing, so that changes, but it's one entire outfit. Her shoes do also come off, so those are all accessories going on there. So here's the little accessory box going on here, and it's very, very tiny. It's got a little fake shipping label uh, from Boxy Girls to my best friend. Uh, supposedly the weight is 2.5 pounds. I don't think so. <laughs> That's uh, you got. You need to relook at your scale. Okay, so there is some, at least it's paper, uh, there is some paper packing material, uh, and a little yellow purse, which I would like to see not be one solid color, because it looks like it has some details that could stand out a little better if they were different colors, but you know... It, don't ask anything from your your cheap cheap toys. Um, okay, so her arm doesn't move at all, so I don't know <laughs> how they expect her to carry a purse. Um, but okay, so uh, I mean, I guess okay, I guess that hand that hand is flipped up enough to hold a purse. So jokes on me. There was a way, I just picked the wrong hand. Um, so here is our boxy girl. She is pretty cute. Um, and I knew this going in, but like, I'm just not super fond of like all plastic dolls and like the plastic clothing. I'd almost like her better if her clothing wasn't interchangeable, um, especially since it looks like, unless there's a lot more uh, clothing than there are the dolls, um, it looks like there's only the six, and so you can only swap them between these these six. Um, although this, you know, is probably only like series one or two of whatever, you know? So there, there should, in theory, be more eventually, unless they don't sell well, which maybe they won't. <laughs> um, she fell over. All right, and let's take a look at the pet here. This is what I'm really excited about. Oh, kitty! I, I am going to uh, make a size comparison here in a second, but let me open this up. What? The cat has motion and the doll doesn't? 
the cat can 360 its head and the doll can't even move its arms. Are you kidding me? Are, what? <laughs> Why are the pets better than the girls? Anyway, also, either these are like babies, uh, or still, um, that cat is nearly as big as that girl. <laughs> that is quite a size difference. Um, I would imagine that this uh, probably goes better with the actual full-size boxy girl, um, and this will, this shall be her pet. Ooh, I dropped on her head. And I feel really bad about it, even though it's a clump of plastic. <laughs> anyway, let's uh, see what the pet's accessory is. Uh, this way up, fragile. Oh no, I already turned it upside down like five times. Again, 2.5 pounds. Um, are these? Well, they are the same. So at least, uh, so in the boxy world, this a purse weighs 2.5 pounds in a box like this, plus whatever's in here also weighs that. Oh, okay, so this is wrapped in paper because there's a lot, uh, or <laughs> just a couple of pieces. Um, yep, there's, okay, there's lots of pieces here because these are, <laughs> all right, all right, these are slippers and I believe a collar. Um, let's get them on screen a little bit there. So they were wrapped in the paper, which again, thank goodness it was paper. Uh, they still used a little more plastic than they really should have. Um, and in theory, I can reuse these boxes at least. Um, I'm not going to keep the paper. I'm just not. Um, but these could be reused as part of the toy. Uh, so that's, that's good. These are... I can make the cat stand on the box. Um, so, these are slippers for this cat. <laughs> you have to figure out which side is the correct side, all right? It does have left and right. And at least it's not for individual slippers, because um, that would be the worst, and I would lose those immediately, even as an adult, and I can't imagine how it child would keep track of that, but at least it's two sets, um, and they're like molded together. Uh, so that is a, that is a cat in slippers. That's surely interesting. And now this color to hide that's, oh, 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 oh. shoes down. Had to crawl on the floor, but I did find it. I've got the collar on upside down. Um, so we'll fix that. <laughs> the bell faces down. <clears throat> I didn't realize it was a bell at first, but there's a bow, and then what's underneath is definitely supposed to be a little bell. And that kind of hides the giant gaping neck seam a little bit. Uh, not a whole lot, but if you kind of, if you kind of push it up in the front, it kind of does. <laughs> I really like the collar, uh, it's cute that it has a collar, but I feel like these shoes are just gonna continue to fall off, but maybe not. Um, I just I just can't believe it has such a wide range of motion and the the other doll didn't at all have anything. Whatever. Um, so yeah, final final opinion. Uh, kitty cat much cuter than the doll, but I was, I knew that that was going to be my opinion anyway, <laughs> um, so, uh, I'm not surprised, and I'm, uh, like, I'm not unhappy. These don't seem, um, too poor of quality for what they are. Um, the paint jobs aren't like horribly screwed up or anything like that and uh yeah they they look nice nice clean and just not a uh, super something I would go on to continue to collect um 
maybe the animals because uh, there is a hamster called Yummies. Uh, what is the cat's name? Cat's name is Stripes. My cat doesn't have any stripes. <laughs> I can only guess that this is stripes, but the, on the package there, it's a tabby. But it's obviously just a, well, purplish black cat uh, here in reality. So, I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, that, that hamster named Yummies looks super cute. Um, but I don't know that I actually will go out of my way to try to uh, collect more of those. But they were really cool to check out for one time. So that's a plus. Anyway, that is all for today. And I will see you treasures next time.